Assalamu alaikum dear youth this is a message for you and i need you to pay special attention and focus to this important message i see a lot of you struggle with their parents you talk about parents not understanding you and parents claim you not being able to understand them do you actually understand that the connection building or the relationship building is a two way street you need to work on that trust and understand that your parents are given the responsibility a clear job description of caretaking or nurturing and safeguarding you and protecting you supporting you making you happy by allah subhanahu wa taala and they are actually fulfilling their job like it or not they have their own ways like it or not they have to fulfill their responsibility like it or not they don't always make you happy because they don't wake up in the morning to make you happy they wake up in the morning to make allah subhanahu wa taala happy by presenting the best foot forward to fulfill their responsibilities it's very important for you to understand and get it here before before you expect them unlimitedly to make you happy and and they're also given special rights by allah subhanahu wa taala because of the, all their care allah subhanahu wa taala repeatedly spoke about your mother who actually bore you inside her for 9 months and then she delivered you into this world with so much difficulty pain and uh, strength right and then after that since since you're a very big piece of a small piece of flesh she actually took care of you till you become an old enough person to actually tell her that she does not do anything to tell her that she does not know better to tell her that to, that she is not right her parenting is not right imagine imagine who are you to actually tell her that who are you to actually challenge her authority given by allah subhanahu wa taala so your parents especially your mother is given the authority of taking care of you of surpassing so many desires of you by fulfilling her responsibility by allah subhanahu wa taala the very creator you talk about when you're talking about your rights so remember when you talk about your rights you should also remember your responsibility of obedience your responsibility of respect your responsibility of caring your parent that are that you are commanded with by allah subhanahu wa taala directly in quran don't say even off to your parents be be respectful to your parents your parents deserve the best excellence of your manners and your attitude other like none other so this is what allah subhanahu wa taala told you what did allah tell in quran uh, to parents about your respect about your care i hardly remember anything why because it's a default mechanism allah subhanahu wa taala being the biggest the best ever psychologist knows the human psyche knows the human psychology knows the human behavior he has installed a default mechanism of care the nurturing the patience the strength among your parents right so allah subhanahu wa taala has made this default mechanism so he did not give them a command to actually respect you or love you or care for you because he knows that regardless of what you do to your parents they will care for you they will love you no matter what unconditionally so it's the onus is, is on you respect them because you're commanded respect them because you need it respect them because you are ordered by the very creator and if you don't do that it's your loss not their loss because allah subhanahu wa taala has given them their utmost highest level of respect and the highest level of value in his oh, uh, eyes uh, by making them parents for you it's now you the ball is in your court you respect them you love them you care for them or you want to be rude disrespectful or insulting to them because it's going to form or deform your grade so remember that keep me in your duas inshallah and keep writing to me for messaging and for the topic ideas assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh